going on, SK? If this was a tooth loss challenge, I would feel a lot better about my, my chances. But it's not. It's another weight loss challenge that I'm probably not going to win. And you guys can give me shit for not being positive about it. That's fine. But I figure at least this way, if I go into it with a shitty attitude at the end of it, if I don't lose any weight, I won't be shocked. And if I do, bonus! And I know that's a shitty way to go about something, but hey, the man challenged me, so I gotta accept, right? I do have some ideas to maybe help myself lose a little weight this time around. Will they work? I don't know. The first thing I'm trying to do is cut out Cokes. And if I could eliminate Coca-Colas from my diet completely, and not drink Diet Coke, I think that alone would probably help me drop 30 pounds. But I know me, I love my Cokes, and ACP Carter reminded me last week how bad the caffeine headaches were gonna be if I quit cold turkey. And I reminded him that he was right, and I'm not gonna quit cold turkey. Usually by 420. Hey, it's 420. Smoke up, everybody. Usually by 420 on any given day, I've had three to four to five, 12 to 16 ounce cans or bottles of Coca Cola. Today I have had zero so far, but I did get to buy some Sprites. Getting off topic here. It's Monday, and I just got pulled over. Probably for no fucking seatbelt, would be my guess. I think I already know what it is. What'd you throw out? Oh, I didn't throw nothing out. Did that come flying out of the back of you? Probably, yeah. Uh, I thought you were pulling me over for my seatbelt. <laughs> oh, you didn't have seatbelt on? No, I didn't. Oh, that's another issue then. Yeah, I guess. Open your mouth, huh? Yeah. <laughs> but no, I, I haven't thrown nothing out. I was well, actually... Flying out, it looked like you come out of the window. Can I get out? All right, thank you, bud. Well, that was nice of him. Well, that would be your first traffic stop in BVD Films history cop actually thought I had thrown something out my window, which if I needed I would have video proof that I didn't because I was vlogging, doing something else probably illegal. Uh, oh, and by the way, uh, how do you think that stop back there would have went uh, had I been one of those cop watching fucks that like to push cops buttons guy didn't ask me for my ID didn't ask me for my license or registration uh, th there are ways to go about handling cops I think in a way that doesn't if they are dickheads push their buttons to where they become one 
you know, or if they're a strictly by the books cop, make them go through every detail of every traffic stop. Now, realistically, he had the right to ask me for my driver's license and registration because <coughs> he thought I threw something out the window. Once he got here and saw that there was no one in the passenger window or in the passenger seat, I don't know if he realized at that point he was wrong or, or what, but in other words, he didn't go through the whole friggin' spiel of checking me out, which he probably could have. That's how a lot of cops arrest criminals that have warrants. You know, just horse shit luck pulling them over for something simple driving around like that. Oh, and did you notice how I asked if I could get out? Now, I'm sure some of the cop watchers would say, you didn't have to ask to get out of your truck. Well, I don't know if I did or didn't. I just felt, after watching all the cop videos I've watched, that it's better to ask them. Because, you know, number one, if they are the dickhead type cop, that will appease their, their desire to assert authority, if you will. Well, he knew who the boss was, he asked me. You know, that dude, even regardless of how that stop turned out, cops he didn't know if I had a gun over here in my right hand and was gonna step out and smoke him uh, he didn't know any of that so that's why I asked and so anyway just completing completing the talk about the traffic stop other than being a dumbass and putting my foot in my mouth about the seat belt did I handle the stop okay? Did he handle the stop okay? What do you think?